I like to have the two of you here today. You're no friend of mine, because that hand is bloody. Oh, how do you figure that? The blood of badgers, it's on your hand. Oh, okay. I'm Mickey Elliott of the Free the Badger Coalition, and you, my friend, and this whole evil company are murderers of badgers. I, however, will shake your hand because I'm the one who actually has an appointment here today. And I believe in reaching out to people and reaching across the aisle. I'm also running for governor. <laughs> no, this very passionate young person seems to have joined my meeting by her own accord. I'm Geraldine Jones of Badger. A Badger just the one. It stands for Big American Dreams Garner Eventual Resolution. <laughs> you suits have your acronyms today. In your ivory tower, all the world is on fire and the badgers are being poisoned. I was working my way up to that. Well, this must be a misunderstanding, as of course, Arco would never poison any badgers. You see, that's where I may need to gently push back, as a recent survey yields over 200 deceased badgers around the lake. Like could be anything, teenagers or coyotes or something. Yes, but then of course we have 17 badgers in deep comas, 8 badgers with deep-seated psychological problems, and 5 badgers with an extra eye. <laughs> now, I'm a simple citizen. I may not be a scientist, but I know how many eyes a badger is supposed to have. Fewer than three. Some may only have one, but they should definitely have fewer than three. Exactly. And the experts we consulted all agree. It has to be something getting dumped into lake. A lot of it. Let's say this were the case. I'm not saying that it is. If it were, you wouldn't be able to prove it was Arco. Well, you do have your headquarters right here. Circumstantial. How about a record of you guys actually doing it? <laughs> and here's a video I took on March 16th of Arco, of those Arco guys. You see those Arco guys um, in the jackets with the truck? Man, wouldn't this look so bad if somebody saw us? I mean, this is literally Fox of Wait, I don't want these fingers in my car. Trey, just throw them in the bush. See how this could look a little incriminating? Out of context. Uh, yo, here's the con- NOT NOW, SAM! For the love of Pete, I am dealing with a situation here! A situation with these, um, confused but lovely people. Why don't, why don't I take this and have somebody look into it? Meanwhile, Sam, why don't you get some orders from these fine people? I don't want your blood coffee. We, we don't have any blood coffee. <laughs> <laughs> In that case, I'll take some with some milk. Do you have any tea? Yeah, but it's in a cabinet and it's really far away. And I don't want to walk all the way over there just to get it. I but I too have coffee with them. To support the great dairy farmers of this nation. Let's go, Sam. <laughs> now, I don't normally condone impersonating foliage, but this is a really strong case. Thanks, Gov. Normally I'd say your reports are a bunch of pointless legacies. But honestly, this one is pretty useful. Why, I appreciate your gumption. You know, as a young rap scout and myself, I'd hide in the bushes too. <laughs> Listen to me, Sam. Uh, I don't want to. This little problem is going to be swept under the rug with one tidy flick of my broom. We're gonna put the hippie in a bat in a coma with the badger poison and praying the West Wing wannabe to the crime. Yes, the story will utterly eclipse the story of us putting badger poison in the lake and I will prove my loyalty to Jay Leslie and rise to power as I've always dreamed. Sorry, I stopped listening halfway through. Is it a coma? The mastermind monologues are completely wasted on you. Okay, here, take this marker and mark these cups so there's absolutely no room for screw-ups. That one is the one with the milk in it. This one is the one with almond milk. And this is the one with the badger poison. What, what are you doing? I'm drawing little badgers. <laughs> they all have to look the same. Fine, I can draw two badgers. That'll look weird. Chill out. All of the cups will have badgers. <laughs> what do you think a badger looks like? And the next thing you knew, we were eating quesadillas with Steve Carell. That is the <laughs> coolest thing I've ever heard. I guess my youth was a bit wild, but where do you think Sparky Randall and the little 
underling ones. They're probably planning to assassinate us. Now, Mickey, let's not villainize those with whom we hope to reach an understanding. You saw those guys in there, they're fully evil. But we do want something from them, don't we? Yeah, but I think it's fine to know who you're dealing with. I think you've got to consider what Ronald Reagan once said. I will not. <laughs> Thank you so much for your incredible patience, everyone. It's such a pleasure to be working with such dedicated individuals. Sam! And here's Sam with that coffee we all love so much. I'm such a bear without my coffee. Love that Java. Why are you acting weird? Why, whatever do you mean? Here we are, one for you, one for you, and one for me. Did you draw little raccoons on these? <laughs> they're badgers, and they're quite exquisite. Of course they are! Don't be rude, Mickey! Why did you draw badgers on these? Did you fill them with badger poison? Uh, <laughs> I noticed nobody is saying no. Come on, Mickey. Surely it's a little aggressive to assume that Randall here is going to poison us with badger poison through coffee. I mean, they left with the badger poison and then came back with these cups, and now everyone is laughing about it? How is nobody seeing this? <laughs> Nikki, accusing someone of poisoning you can really damage a new friendship with a political toner or ally. Yeah, well, I'm not gonna polite myself into a coma. Whoops, hold on one second. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, Sam! <laughs> uh, sorry, I forgot about the, the thing. Forgot about what? What? That one had the better badger on it. <laughs> okay, shall we? I'm not drinking this. No, 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 look, they all have badges on them. It's a fun touch, because we care. See, Mickey, everyone's acting in good faith. If it makes you feel any better, I'll switch no! with you. I oh. mean, oh. let's all just calm down and drink our lovely beverages. How about you drink yours first? Um, let's see. Sam, are you quite certain that everybody has what they ordered? Uh-huh. <laughs> Is that a yes? <laughs> yeah, <Marino. laughs> Come on, I need a yes before I do this. Yes or whatever. Jeez, micromanage much? Not <laughs> yes or whatever. I need a yes or no. These definite yes and no's, what do they even mean? <laughs> they mean I need you to do something for once and tell me you're absolutely certain it's the correct cup of coffee. I am absolutely certain. <sighs> to the health and safety of badgers everywhere, however many eyes they may or may not have. See, Mickey, trust. That's the beginning of a conversation. Yeah, but it's a weird one, though. Sam. Am, Sam, what have you done? I am absolutely certain, certain that this is... It's regular milk, isn't it? I wanted to say that. <laughs> oh, God, man. I am certain that this is regular milk. <laughs> and for those of you who don't know, Sparky Randall is indeed lactose <laughs> intolerant. Why? Ah! <laughs> I mean, I insulted him constantly. That, that's probably it. No, Sparky. Uh, no, Sparky. <sighs> It goes deeper, more insidious. Yeah. Everyone insults me. Uh, I am uh, But you, you made me do things. Uh, I'm almost afraid to ask, but what kind of thing? When the doorbell rang, I had to go open the door with my own two hands. And when Granite clicked your hands, ready to get more? Me. And I, and I, uh, forgive me, but I stapled things. Like someone's uncle who is important. Like nepotism isn't even real. Oh, gross. Nepotism is Wait, so you're just mad you had to do work? I had to have you do things, Sam. I had to prove my worth to Jay Leslie Island, and I, I had to, I, I was willing to poison them for it. Wait, what? Poison got me into this meeting. I figured it could get me out. Mickey, I'm so sorry. I should have never been ah! there. I never thought that Randall would poison us with coffee. I hate to say I told you so, but I had pretty much thought <laughs> And now, never again will I not watch YouTube videos under your tyranny. Now, your two little birdies will go flying away, telling all of your secrets. And my uncle, 
My uncle will be important forever. I, I gotta get to an important meeting down the Just hall. Just a second, friend. What are you doing? This is a serious matter. I think it's time for a little productive compromise. What? I'll let you go as long as you promise to never poison the badgers of the lake again. Fine! We gotta get out of here! Alright, let's go on for the badgers and Link who got off their high horse. Honestly, Mickey, before you came along, I was getting a little too overly focused on my career. I remembered why I came into politics. To get in the bushes and clean up around here. Hey, maybe I ought to swing by our office and then we should run for something. Yeah, you should just swing by my office. We could do some really great things together. Please don't talk like that in front of me. I find it really offensive. What's offensive? Doing things. <laughs> Enjoy doing nothing while you can, Sam. Because if you harm another human or woodland creature, you'll be hearing from us. So like, I'd have to answer the phone? That's just the beginning, Sam. There are <laughs> emails. No. We'll schedule meetings every week. You wouldn't. I'll send you a fax. So help me, I will fax you. <laughs> No. <laughs> Goodbye, Sam. For now. Uh, <laughs> I hate doing things. <laughs>